As we're reading Revelation chapter 5 today, it opens like a stage play in heaven, centered around the throne of God, with John telling us what he sees. God is sitting on the throne with a scroll in his right hand. The scroll is remarkable, with writing on both sides, and it's sealed seven times over. Who can open the scroll, an angel asked. And John begins to weep because there's no one who can open the scroll and read it. Then one of the elders around the throne tells John, stop weeping, there is one who can open the scroll. John describes this person as the lion of the tribe of Judah, the root of David. He has won the victory, John says, and he looks like a lamb that was slain. That's right, it's Jesus. Jesus is worthy to open the scroll. And when he takes the scroll from the hand of God, worship breaks out in heaven. We're told that those around the throne sing a new song. You are worthy to take the scroll and to break the seals and open it. For you were slaughtered and your blood has ransomed people for God from every tribe and language and people and nation. And you have caused them to become a kingdom of priests for our God and they will reign on the earth. It's a new song because Jesus makes all things new. It's new that God would come as a man, new that he would shed his blood to redeem us from our sins. It's new that we're sealed with the Holy Spirit of promise and that we're a royal priesthood and that we'll establish a new kingdom on this earth. Let me encourage you to set aside some time today and read Revelation chapter 5 to take in this great heavenly scene in its entirety. And as you do, join in and worship the Lord, for He is worthy of it all.